So, tonight's vlog is sponsored by Publix Food and Pharmacy <laughs> of Celebration, Florida. And the Earhart family. And the Earhart family, but we're just kidding. But it kind of is sponsored by the Earhart family. We're going on a hunt for balloons. The Earharts land in approximately like 45 minutes. That means they'll get the property in about an hour and a half. Hour and 15. Are they flying in the Sanford like they usually do? No, they're flying in MCO because they came from our good old town, Chicago. And I forgot a hat, but we have to show you. We got a bunch of treats for them, but we're looking for balloons. Because balloons. Balloon looks like who doesn't love a good balloon? When you arrive at Disney World. I'm over here like, I don't see the kind of balloons we need. And Sarah's like, Peter, you're being a little bit of a dope. We buy the classic balloons and then they fill them up. We need classic red. Um, so we got someone, that, someone's gonna come over and help us out, but look at this. We were like, why does it smell like cinnamon so much? Cinnamon whisks, what is this used for? Not for consumption. Try to Get swept out. away with scents of the season, yeah. so it just smells? Yeah. We should get one, they're 99 cents. It smells so good and delicious. Mm. Christmas time is here. Bum, ba bum 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 bum. We got some red balloons cause we're obnoxious, right Sarah? Actually, one of these balloons is coming home with us as a uh, part of my costume. Time to go to Roldaner's Lodge. <laughs> I think we're here a little early. Well, we're just gonna sit in this beautiful resort. Maybe go look at that Halloween stuff over there. But, oh, these are new. These are new couches. These are, new. These are brand, you heard it here first from the Burkhart Project exclusive. Brand new couches. I'll let you know how it feels. Oh, there's, you sink into it. You sink into it, it's so comfy. Okay, this was all like fun and stuff, running and rushing here to get this all awesome setup for them. We're right by the door. But now, the painstakingly annoying part is having to wait for them. So we're like maybe gonna go into Magic Kingdom for a little bit. But, but we like got here just too late. Yeah. I mean, I don't mind sitting here. Oh, neither do I. These, but I just wish they were here. These couches are comfy. And I did want to make sure that, like, what if these were taken? We would have kind of had to, like, wait around until they... Yeah. So we kind of took over this little section <laughs> of this little, like, love seat and the half of this couch here. So we got the balloons for everybody. We have Snow and Prince for Katrina, right? Yeah. Pooh Bear for Kaylee. Kieran has his lightsaber, and there's a little Magic Kingdom map for the parents, and this is what they were expecting. We picked it up for them the other day. Um, we just heard them say we need ketchup. And the Earhart's landed. They text us. Yeah. But we don't know where they are. I know. We're trying to get our... I'm never so going to not tell us they're here, because we didn't tell them what we're doing. But they're just going like, to pop up into this lobby. Oh, listen, this is my song. It's from Little bear. Women. No, it's from Little Women. Does anybody know if you can buy the soundtrack for this lobby? That would be nice. Or Little Women. First of all, it's 9.30, <laughs> and they still haven't left their Magical Express yet, but this awesome setup has to move. <laughs> we realize that they are in... They're staying in Boulder Ridge. They're staying in Boulder Ridge, and here Sarah was like, well... What if they don't know where they're going? Well, first of all, I think we've told them a million times where to go. Because we do, we but, go there constantly. But here's my logic is, there is a chance that they don't show up here, in this building, right? Through this they lobby. Have their, they have their room number. They don't have their room number, their magic bands will work. There's a chance they don't come through here. But there's a 100% chance they go into the lobby of the building that they're staying in because there's only one way in. So we gotta move this fun display over yonder. This night, 
is amazing and hilarious because Sarah just heard back from them. They've never been here before. How are they our friends? And they've never been here before. I think it goes to show how much they trust the building and us that they've been staying here for like a whole week. They're, they just told us that they're, they've ne since they've never been here, they're actually gonna come in through the main lobby. So now that we've done that whole tour and that awesome stuff, by the way, I love a good excuse to walk through this building. And we'll be back because this is where the room is. Um, we're gonna take all that stuff back to the main lobby and hopefully that spot's set up. But Sarah, this building is beautiful. There's things that we've never even seen. We stayed here. We stayed third floor, I think, even. This is our new, this is our new home. What is this? Guys, 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 welcome home and thank you for being our guest. We'd like to share our appreciation for you, for your patience while we're working, uh, working our magic around the resort with these special keepsakes as our gift to you. And it's a, it's a construction, focus. That's awesome. Construction Mickey, Pluto, that and really Chip and cool. Dale. Gonna, let's go out to the balcony. Hold on, we have to put Stacy on. Is it? There's so many doors. What? <laughs> <laughs> there, there are three doors right here. Perfect. Yeah, we were because we were we were the main part. All right, back to back to the main building. This spot looks familiar. Uh, we're back at it. They're coming in through the main lobby, like we said, because they've never been here, and we have to give them the Brookhart tour of the Wilderness Lodge. So we are back. They are on the bus. We don't know if they've left yet, but they're still probably 40 minutes out. But now we know for certain that they're here, they're coming to the main lobby. Sarah's gonna set it up. They should walk through those doors, hopefully any minute now. The Earhart's just told us that the Magical Express Run has people at Grand Floridian, Old Key West, Saratoga Springs, and Wilderness Lodge. They don't know the order yet. So Sarah made herself a little comfy. My neck and shoulders hurt. Yeah, she needed to, it was for medical reasons. <laughs> I think I'm gonna get us some water. Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna go try to get us some cups of water. Then a broom, sweep a broom. The funnest part. Broom, sweep a broom. <laughs> Look at this angle. Broom, sweep. The funnest part about. Uh -huh. um, oh yeah. The funnest part more about. Um, Janitor style. The funniest part about sitting here for a while is seeing everybody's reactions as they walk in the door. I was gonna get them. Like they literally stopped in their tracks. Okay, let's see these people react. But we're gonna. I'm gonna pretend. See? Did you hear him? See? She gasped. And I think she saw me. I think she saw me. Abort mission, abort. Abort mission. Abort, abort. Oh. How are you? Where did you Winnie the Pooh go? We have, we have caused, we have ensued have outrage. In the you have cards in there? Uh -huh. The children are here, and they walked in the door, and we caused them to go absolutely wild. Now there's children running all over the Wilderness Lodge. Where's your Winnie the Pooh? We found Ben and Carolyn. They're here. All of our friends the past couple days have been like, so we're not going to see you for the next like 10 days, right? And we're like, yes, in fact, you probably won't see us for the next 10 days. It's uh, not a proper tour from the Brookhart Projects to first timers without visiting the train room. Oh, cool. Hold on, I got to show Carolyn's bag. Look at this. Chicago Pride. Yay. We wanted to come to Chicago so bad this past weekend and fly down with you guys, but... Oh, it would have been amazing. New job, what are you going to do? Yeah. With the Brookharts? Oh my god. <laughs> Look at it, Stacy! <laughs> and we got balloons. Um, I forgot that we've already stayed in one of these on the Fab Five Two Seven. So we are in a one bedroom. By the way, the entirety of this vlog is this room tour. So thank you for our content, but we realize our entire day is going to be hanging out with you. Crazy because I've seen your guys' video. Yeah. Two years ago. Uh huh. But it's even so much bigger than that. Oh yeah. So you step in, you've got your pack and play. So this is actually, they booked a DVC. 
I remember I put all of my trinkets here on this table. Beautiful ornate details. Pull out to a full. The One of my favorite DVC kitchens is the Wilderness Lodge. Look at that, you can see through, you got that cutting board, the tiles, stainless steel, beauty, beauty, beauty. Bambi set up. Come on, come on. Karen, are you gonna sleep there? Is that gonna be your spot? You just, you did have a long day. You traveled all the way from Chicago. A balcony? Ooh, I don't, they might, I don't know if they have a balcony in their second room. And they have my favorite bathroom set up of any absolute DVC ever. So you walk into the bedroom. Here's, hi you. Hi you. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Sorry for interrupting this room tour. Um, so here's the one bed, the master bedroom. Beautiful. View, no balcony, but view. Look at that US postage. Kill you crazy. <laughs> Into the bathroom. So you got your, your suds. Oh, the safe is right here. So that's where Ben's gonna put all of his loose change and gold bricks that I'll be taking later this week. Okay, I gotta find Katrina. Here's the bathroom, the water closet, and I gotta find Katrina. Where could Katrina be? You know what, I'm so tired, I need to take a break. It's been such a long day. Oh! I got a Look, Sarah. <laughs> what is this? Oh my gosh, I better drink up. What is this? Garden? What is it called? Garden Girl? Garden Grocers. Garden Grocers. This is how you vacation. I t Sarah, it's... <laughs> Like getting this much water in the I'm gonna be honest, like, like five dollars Let's be honest, at least half of one of these cases is gonna get consumed by Sarah and myself. Yeah, that's true. I, I feel like we're planning for we all on a scale one to we always end up with less water at the end than we thought we would. Yes. <laughs> Carolyn, Ben, you've been here for about an hour. Yeah, yeah. On a scale of one to ten, on a scale of one to Brookhart, how close are you to highly considering buying a DVC at the end of this trip? <laughs> Like a seven? Uh, give me well, a give me a six or seven. I've always been at like a six. Okay. And this is probably putting us up to like an eight. Okay. I got a week and to work on this. This room, this room and this resort, because we've never been here at all. Like I mean I like this better than oh. I like it. Okay. Okay. What are you gonna say? I want Sarah to make a montage of how many times Peter says the Grand Floridian is. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. I'm like, ah. But this is better. This, this, this is, is no, 100%. This is 100% better than the Grand Floridian. I say that because I'm there in a moment, but yeah, this right. is my place. This is just cozy. Exactly. Totally different vibe. Cozy. Yeah. Awesome. Like, I could see buying a DVC here for sure. But there's, my, there's the problem. So, but only from our favorite DVC set. Yeah. <laughs> Brennan? <laughs> the thing is, when you buy, so what's available though to buy? If you're Alani, buying direct, if you're buying direct Alani, buying direct. you can find. We can find you. I'll, I'll talk to. I got. I got some people. I got some people. We'll find you old. We'll find you wilderness lodge contracts. Yeah. We'll get them. We'll get them. <laughs> Great minds think alike. We bring their their children very rambunctious making <laughs> balloons. They bring us Irish soda bed from our nice. favorite favorite Irish soda bed provider, Jewel Hosco. Kaylee gave Peter. Oh, Everything. Good. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you so much. <laughs> You're such a good shirt. Thank you. So much later that the old narrator got tired of waiting and they had to hire a new one. We're so bad. We are so bad. Like scary bad. We're leaving right now. We are so, so bad. <laughs> If you do the math right now, that means we'll be getting into bed to officially go to sleep. Our alarm goes off from right now in three and a half hours. By the time we go to bed, it'll be three hours. Because it is currently about 2.40 in the morning. We are leaving Wilderness Lodge at 2.40. We love the air <laughs> We tell you guys we can't Here. stop, like we can't stop talking. 
It was great seeing them. It was funny trying to set up the proper surprise. I have an issue where I rile up every little child that I ever see. <laughs> and it's, it has been a personal goal of mine to, to stop that, but it's hard. Um, so, Carolyn and Ben, I'm sorry. I'll work on it. Should we and uh, here? it's good to be home. It is good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.